Hey y'all, good morning. What's up? It's your girl back in here with another video. Okay, y'all, so I came on here with an update. It's been a minute. <laughs> I got so much going on. Oh my goodness. Okay, y'all. So, as you guys can see by the title while I'm here, it's a new health update, y'all. Okay. Let me get prepared because this is a lot. This, this is, this is, this is a, uh, I'm about to step into a new, a new, um, a new realm of my life okay so y'all go ahead and get, get comfortable because i got a lot to tell y'all oh my goodness okay so um i'm having problems with my tooth on this side so instead of me brushing my teeth with regular toothpaste i started using coconut oil and baking soda and um so i brushed my teeth or whatever okay so i'm sure y'all know that it gets into your mouth and gets down into your system right okay so um i had just brushed my teeth um and then i had coffee and then i was eating something and as soon as i sat here maybe for about five to ten minutes into eating i don't know what it was because this was like last week and when this happened my stomach started hurting and I was like oh no <laughs> okay yeah y'all know what happened next okay so anyway let me move forward so I went to see my doctor um in January and I had to have a physical so we're going over my, my doctor and I were going over everything and she's talking to me about my pain, um, the level of pain, where my pain is, the issue with my hip. Um, um, she's talking about, like, am I going to the bathroom okay? My cycles, am I still having a cycle? Like, the whole nine. Um, she's, she touched my back, my or my lower back, where my tailbone is, and that, that hurt me so bad then she touched the issue like where I have my the the pain in my hip and that is is excruciating so anyway so she's like well you know your birthday's coming up and I'm like yeah <laughs> and she's like um I think it's time for you to have a colonoscopy and I was like you know what Oh, I said, okay. <laughs> I said, okay. So, I've been brushing my teeth regularly with the baking soda slash coconut oil. And, um, um, it's been, yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, it's been actually taking my appetite away. And then the only thing I've been drinking is coffee with protein mix. I got the, what is it called? What is it called? The Quest Vanilla um, Protein Mix from Costco. No, from Amazon um, a couple of days ago. So that's what I've been mixing my coffee with. And um, I said, I'm not going to brush my teeth until this afternoon. And there's a reason. There's a reason why. I want to be able to have breakfast. <laughs> And then brush my teeth and then wait until dinner to eat. Okay. So y'all don't be like, oh, that's gross. That's gross. Girl, please trust y'all. I have my reasons. Okay. So yesterday morning, um, I brushed my teeth. And then my son-in-law called me and he's like, hey, could you watch the baby? I got a lot of homework I got to do and I, I need some time to myself. I was like, hey, you know, no problem. So I brushed my teeth. Um... And my grandbaby came over, and she had sun chips, um, dried fruit, and I had one sun chip, and I had two pieces of dried fruit. But I had 
a bite, like a piece of the um, Nature Valley granola bar. I just had this, like little bits of food that morning. And um, my stomach was hurting me so bad. It, it hurt me so bad, y'all. I was like bent over in pain. So literally, like I had two movements yesterday, and um, and I say two because the night before I took all my vitamins, and that helps me too. Okay, so I'm doubled over in pain yesterday, and my grandma was like, "Grandma, grandma, are you okay? Grandma, grandma, are you okay?" It was so funny. But anyways, y'all. So okay, so the nurse called me about my procedure, and she's like. She's going down a long list of things that I cannot do. I cannot eat, cannot drink, cannot take. And I take iron. I just started taking iron pills a couple weeks ago, I think. And I have to stop taking those three days before the procedure. Um, I cannot smoke. I cannot drink. I can't smoke weed. I can't drink no alcohol. Um... I think it's like within that week. So that whole week, like the week of the 28th, I'm just going to stop everything. I'm just going to stop everything. There are certain foods I cannot eat. There's certain stuff I cannot drink. And I'm just like, Ugh. then there's the stuff I have to drink for the procedure the night of. Is it the night before? It's, I know it's the morning of the procedure, and I think it's the night before the procedure. Um, <laughs> so right now, um, I was talking to my friend last yesterday and he was like, girl, you better do everything you can and like, you know, not er eat what you can't eat, what you want, drink what you want, smoke what you want <laughs> until that particular week. And I'm like, you know what? I think that's a good idea. <sighs> so I was talking to my mom and she had to have a colonoscopy. Um, I want to say it was some years ago, but I know it was recent. Um, so basically, y'all, I'm like preparing myself for this procedure. So I have to go into um, my my chart and look this stuff up and um, write all this stuff down. What I can I eat? What I have to do? <sighs> so my other friend was like, "Girl, you know your whole diet about to change, right?" After this procedure, but well, basically, well, she said after, but before, like the week before. Oh my god! Like my whole life is about to change. Yeah, it's it's seriously about to change. So, <clears throat> my mom was like, I've lost five pounds <laughs> after that procedure. And I was like, you know what? I said, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. Because I was telling my mom last night, like, I'm tired of being overweight. I'm tired of struggling. And I'm trying my best to do everything I can to, um, to shed this weight. So, this is a good start. Okay? So... I look up everything um, is like protein and fiber based. Um, I was gonna get, I was gonna get some chia seeds, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait to do that. Oh, excuse me. Only reason why I say I'm gonna wait to do that is because, um, excuse me. I wanna go to. Excuse me. Woo. I'm gonna go to Walmart and price them because I price them in Safeway and they're a bit pricey. So I think I'm just gonna have to go on Amazon and go by size and see how much it would cost on Amazon. So um, I used to get chia. Oh, I used to get chia. It's a chia flaxseed mix. I think that's what I'm gonna look for, but. 
I think they only sell those. They might sell them at Whole Foods. I gotta remember how much I even pay for those. But anyways, yeah, I need to do that. So, um, y'all, I'm just, yesterday, yesterday I had, um, what is that? I had sausage and eggs for dinner. Um, I had avocado toast with the everything, the, ba the bagel seasoning, the everything bagel seasoning. That was really good. Yes, I put cream cheese on the bread too. Um, and then last night I had a bowl of cereal. The only thing is like I changed, um, my milk. Like I only have soy milk, almond, so almond soy milk. If I need to cook like macaroni and cheese yes i still make mac and cheese boo okay um i do get the whole vitamin whole vitamin d whole milk that's just to cook with but i'm pretty sure people are like no try two percent or the low fat okay anyway so um everything is about to change y'all is changing yeah, it's changing. So I'm going to I'm going to do um so that whole the whole this la the last week of February this month, I'm going to do I'm going to let y'all know every day what I'm going to be eating. So, I'm going to uh um trying to figure out how to do this so I know what not to eat. <laughs> Or what I can't have. Y'all, I'm nervous. I'm so nervous about this because I've never had a procedure. I've never had... Well, of course, don't you don't have to have a colonoscopy if you don't have any health issues like that and, and like, intestinal issues. But um, I've never done anything like this. <sighs> ooh, ooh, ooh. So... Sorry, it's it's going to be a major life change for me. Um <coughs> excuse me. <clears throat> oh, these allergies are kicking my butt right now. Um Let me see what else. Yeah, like I want to start um just changing everything. And then last week my daughter and I made um we made tacos. But we instead of us using shells, we used um the romanus romaine romanus <laughs> the romaine lettuce leaves and we put you know the toppings on the romaine lettuce leaves, which was really good. Um and I'm actually glad we did it that way because it's a lot more healthier. Um but the next day I we had leftovers and then I had Frito chips with mine, but I also use the romaine lettuce leaves y'all that was it was a really good idea and I'm glad I told my daughter we we should do that so I told her I said we need to be I need I myself need to be incorporating more veggies with my food so um I do want to get some spinach and I was really trying to figure out um I know stores they sell the spinach and like it's natural, not natural, but fresh is what I mean. So I need to do that. So when I do have eggs or whatever, um, I'll put my, the spinach with eggs, just like the spinach leaves uncooked. So I do it like that. Make sure I have, uh, fruit on the side and some meat protein. Ooh, um, I have been uh, drinking more water. In a day, I had three bottles of water, four bottles of water yesterday. Ooh. I'm tired. I'm sorry. Ooh, okay. So, um, all right, y'all. That's that's what I came up here to update, y'all. I'm really, I'm just trying to get everything down. I'm trying to get everything down. I'm trying to get all this stuff in my brain. I'm trying to process this right and make sure that I'm set. And my mom was telling me about the stuff I could have. So she said chicken broth. <clears throat> <laughs> I 
So we're going to go ahead and start consuming that as well. And Jello. She said, lime, lemon lime Jello. No red. Nothing red. No strawberries. Okay. Anyways, y'all. So she was telling, my mom was telling me about her procedure. And how that happened. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take my nap before my grandbaby get here. Okay, so y'all, that is the end of this video. Um, um, but yes, I will keep y'all updated about the week before, and y'all pray for me, cut because I need to make sure that I have self control. Um. I did not, so when my, when my daughter and I went grocery shopping, we didn't buy junk food. I made sure that everything I got was healthy, okay? So we're going to do, we got skinless boneless chicken. Um, I'm going to actually make that into some kind of crock pot meal, which I actually need to look that up. Because we do have a crock pot, crock pot cookbook. So I need to do that. Um... I did, did get the different color bell peppers, too. Um, I want to um, get another thing of cream cheese. and Because I saw this recipe on Pinterest that has bell peppers and cream cheese and stuff. And I want to do that. So I want to get cream cheese and some more avocados. And then have that, with, make that with the um, everything bagel seasoning i think that would be good too to start doing that more so yes y'all i am just I'm, i feel good like i'm feeling really good today i didn't sleep much but that's okay <clears throat> um i'm feeling good i really am i'm feeling good i'm excited i really am ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, sorry for all this yawning but anyways i feel really good about starting this um I don't call it my weight loss journey, but I feel like I'm just getting better about myself and um, being better about my health. Yeah, yeah. So I'm excited, and um, I'm not, I think I'm excited about losing weight and feeling better. You know, everything's just about to be everything's about to change for me, and even though. It may seem like it's going to be a lot for me to um, not, well, every, it's going to be a lot for me to take in, but it's going to be me just feeling a whole lot better about myself because sometimes I don't. So, yeah, I'm I'm on the right track. I really am. Um, my, I did a blood panel back in January. Um, my doctor's concerned about my blood sugar levels are borderline, so that's good. Um, my doctor says she's concerned about my, I'm not sure if it's my sodium intake or my cholesterol, one of them too, but yes, that's about to change too. So, all right, y'all, I will talk to you guys later. I will be updating y'all more within the next couple more weeks and um just hoping all this goes well <laughs> with on my part yeah on my part so you guys have a good day and i will talk to you later